what's up youtube welcome back to another fishing mission i here on a kayak this evening sun's about an hour and a half out from going down got a couple different baits tied up we're gonna get out here and see if we can find them let's go all right let's start right here So if you guys have been seeing any of my videos on the kayak recently, I've been killing it with this little all black crankbait. That's why it's all beat up. This thing's been putting in work for me though. I'm gonna start with this today. See if it's still working. Yes, sir. He's tiny, but we'll take it. First fish of the day. Didn't leave myself enough slack. Rookie move. There you go, though. First fish of the day. Just a little bass. I'll take it though. Get the skunk out the boat. Another one. Ooh, this one feels way better. Oh, this is a good one, guys. Come here, buddy. Oh my God, it's a tank. Got him. Yes. Oh my God. There it goes. Look at that fish, y'all. That is a freaking tank. That's gotta be at least three pounds. Let me get back from this bank a little bit. Yo. That's the second big fish I caught on this little black meeting crankbait, y'all. That is crazy. Look at that thing. Yes, sir. That's going on a stringer. If you guys can't tell, when I get excited, my voice gets high pitched. That's a freaking tank, y'all. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, 
Damn, this thing almost slipped a little kayak over right here. All right, we've made a pass on this bank with this crankbait. We'll put this up and drift back down the other direction. This one, which is just a little black and pink curly tail on the jig head. Oh, got one. Right here, a little crappie. It's a, just in the boat. It was just sitting there. Tiny crappie. Take it though. First fish on this one. Third fish overall. Two bass and a crappie so far. Almost lost this pole again. I was just readjusting the boat. Cut the camera off. Has us just sitting off the side of the boat. On, this little thing snatched it. Almost pulled the rod in. I've lost this pole like four times. I've had to get pulled in, and I've got it back every time. That's crazy. Got one. That's a decent one. Jump in the boat then. There we go. Fish number five. Bass number three. Another smaller one. And like I said, this crankbait is attracting the bass. And that little paddle tail is attracting the crappie. Keep working this. Whoa. Oh, it came off right here. Dang it. That was crazy. He jumped out the water. Got one. Crappy on the crankbait. Okay. I'll take it. I think this number is six or seven total. Third crappie, I believe. If I remember correctly. Another crappie. Oh, it came off right here. Yep. Another crappie, though. Right up underneath this tree. Let's see if there's any more up under there. Another one. Yep. Right away. What's this? Yep. Another small crappie. Okay, so a little school of crappie seemed to have moved up underneath this little tree right here. Another crappie. Mm. 
green one under there. Let's see. All right, y'all. That's going to do it for today's video. Came out here, was able to catch me a big old bass, probably like in the three to four pound range. And I think I caught probably total of eight or nine fish, something in that range. All crappie and bass today. The uh, bass were all caught on the crankbait, and then all but one of the crappie were caught on the little uh, paddle tail. I've been, I've been killing it with that combination of baits this fall so far. One hard bait, like a crankbait, and then one soft bait of some kind. Today it was a little paddle tail. I've used, you know, paddle tails, curly tails, whatever. Combination of the two seemed to do the trick. But uh, yeah, I'm going to get out of here. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Make sure you like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.